Just come outside, we're meant to be going to a friend's birthday get together thing in the Utes flat. Oi. Hey mate, how's it going? Nah, just another day in the life, eh? Hey? I'm just gonna put it on charge and go from there. Well, there you go. Righto, so the plan so the plan is I think Jack the plan is to put the battery on charge, yeah? Yep. And just hopefully it'll charge it enough to get it going pretty shortly and it won't take too long. Bulking. Now we just sit and wait. Where are we going? We are up and running. An hour and a half later. Yeah, it took about an hour and a half. Beautiful. So after getting the car started, leaving, driving, part of the way through town to go and get fuel, we realised we didn't have Jack's wallet. So we turned around, came back, got the wallet, started driving out again, realised we didn't have our sneakers to hike down to the waterfall that we're going to. So we have turned around again. We're gonna go back to the caravan, get our sneakers, then go and get fuel, the people, then drive an hour. Some of, people, <laughs> some of the people at the caravan park just looked at me like, what the fuck are they doing? <laughs> yeah, we got we got yeah, an hour drive, hour and a half. Yes, and we're already an hour and a half late. Um, what else am I thinking of? It's a saying. Piss poor preparation equals piss poor performance. It's just been one of them weekends, hasn't it? Yeah. So anyway, we'll get there eventually. We eventually made it onto the road and drove an hour out to Lake Argyle where we would be meeting friends at Homestead Falls. It was my first time out there and I was pretty impressed straight away. I can't wait to spend some more time there. Apparently the falls get really pumping after big rain, but it was perfect for a swim while we were there. We were wondering where the boys were. And next minute I walk over and they just come swimming back. It took us about 15 minutes to walk there, but you can also get there by boat, which is what we would do next time. We go on fishing. No, we're going we go on fishing. <laughs> we're not. I'm this gonna is... put, hmm? I'm gonna put some fresh 50 pound leader on. I'm gonna go smack a couple. We're going to Coles. Oh, got a bit pink, eh? Pardon? Gotten a bit pink. Been running the long sleeves and now I'm getting real pale. This is our third attempt at getting Pancake mix. Now I know what you're saying. Quite easy to make your own. Bit of flour, a few eggs, done. But, but, you get that, you get that mix in the bottle. Get that mix in the bottle, shake it up, make sure you get, I think it's buttercream or whatever it is. Buttermilk, really butter buttermilk. No, I really want the, um, the chopped chip ones. Anyway, we went to Coles the other day, couldn't get them. They're out of stock of pretty much everything. Then we went to Tucker Box, still couldn't get them. So we're going back to Coles. We're going back to Coles to see if we can get Tucker Box is IGA by the way. You are right there? I'm gonna get some bacon, a bit of maple syrup, a few strawberries. Get excited. Very nice. I love ice cream 
and maple syrup on my pancakes, but Jack usually does bacon. Bacon and maple syrup. Bacon and maple syrup, but today's having ice cream because we don't have bacon. With strawberries. No. It's good, but I just feel like you can't beat ice cream. And if you like, Macca's hotcakes. Pretty confident that's the same. <laughs> that's the same one. So that tastes pretty good. Similar recipe. Yeah, as Macca's. What's it called? Maple syrup. Yeah, on the hotcakes. Yeah. Quick for a cold. We mostly spent the week fishing along the banks of the lower Ord or from the tinny in the upper Ord. Jack caught a couple of barra and it was really nice to have a few quiet days. Someone's bloody. Oh, the lobster thrown it or left it here when it's got a big hole in it. And eating extra stuff like this lying around. Just made a mess of it now. It's pretty good to get rid of it. Oh, so yeah. more things don't get caught in it. And end up back in the water. End up back in the water. Bloody grubs. Oh. Probably got snagged and lost it. Looks like it's come down in that last storm. Run of water, yeah. Yeah. I did check if it was salvageable, but it's got a big old hole in it, so bugger it. Mm. Let's keep going, boss. On to the next spot. On to the next one. fishing rod boss. Here's a cool little croc slide. Right there, going down into the water. A few days old, but... What was that? A few days old, but still pretty cool. Yeah. Be cool if we can see some fresh ones. There's another little cool one here where he's come for a big walk all around the dunes. You see he dragging his tail and slid in there. Yeah, we just saw a croc just up here on the bank too, but he was hidden, tucked away in behind the trees in the shade. night of hunting. <laughs> I think there's something dead up there, belly up in the water. Yeah. What is that? I think it's a dead croc. I can see it, it's like, that's just up here, you can't see it on camera. I don't know, it's tough. Belly up croc or... I don't know. We didn't see too many crocs while we were out fishing on this particular day, but we were there again later that night and had the spotlight with us and saw about five all in this one spot. So they're definitely there even when you can't see them.
camera. Yeah. I'm gonna lose him, you ready? Yeah. There's your dinner. How good's that? I knew he was there. Yeah. We need a feed. Really provided, eh? Perfect. Dinner. Perfect legal order of a barra. He's uh, been in the fresh for a while, but I reckon it still tastes pretty good. Let's take him home and get into it. <laughs> Crop sitting right there. We had a big downpour come through that we hadn't seen on the forecast and we'd left the tinny in. So after a few moments of sheer panic when we couldn't see the boat, Jack decided to go and bring her in because it was a little bit too stressful thinking that we were going to wind up seeing her floating away down the river. Special wedges. Yeah, home cooked wedges. And yeah. a bit of red. And a glass of red. Oh, cheers. <laughs> cheers. They have the most beautiful feathers, see, they got that dots on them wing. Mm. Thanks for watching, and see you next week.